welcome to Surfside. Um, this is one of Universal's Endless Summer Hotels. customer service where you check in and right behind there is Universal Studios store so let's take a look at that and check it out oh, they got all kinds of cool stuff in here but they are not 70 so they they're marked down from 70 to 35 39 39 yes. I marked down from 70 yeah. At 39. Wow. 34, 35, whereas one is $14. Oh, so wow. We sell quite a lot of here. And then this one is a toy as well as the Hogwarts Express. It opens up like this, but the secret is here. This is a magnetic thing. Look. Oh, wow. It's a butterbeer candy. It's <laughs> nice. Oh, nice. Nice. And at home you can put your own popcorn. Mark <laughs> <laughs> down from $140 to $109. So the robes are thing. now $109. Are so make sure you step in at the Universal Studio store. After you get done checking in, go out here and check out the pool. Deep Eddy Orange Vodka with sweet orange and vanilla for a frozen or on the rocks. Creamsicle. Does it taste like a creamsicle? Yes, it tastes just like a creamsicle. Now that you've checked in and been to the pool, let's go get something to eat. Oh, yeah. We've made it to the Beach Break Cafe. And in here, you can grab all kinds of good stuff. Not as much as the sister property of Dockside. Not nearly as big, but much quaint, much more intimate feel and is more quaint than dark side. Yep. And they have chicken and they have pizzas and they've got burgers and they got donuts and they got all kinds of sweet treats and all kinds of snacks. And you can grab it and go. They even have their own drinks here, or at least drinks with their labels on it. <laughs> Orange juice. They need to check out right here. Grab whatever you need. Check out. <clears throat> Got a couple of booths here. Plenty of little places to eat all back in here. A lot more space. Not as open as some of the other places like the sister property has. But like Marcy said, it's a more quaint and then you have your drink station. And a microwave if you need to come down from your room and microwave something or you're out here by the pool. And it's a beautiful lobby. We'll find Marcella here with a special advertisement. So if you need a little pick-me-up, here's a Starbucks right off the lobby. We are in room 1827, one of the best rooms you can have at the Surfside. And I'll show you that in just a minute why I think that, but we've already kind of got our stuff set up here, so don't mind our messy room. But uh, Sister Hotel, Dockside, they have the closet here with a, like a little curtain for a door for the closet. But anyway, you got your nice little sink area set up and all that stuff, plenty of towels, got the mirror, hey, there I am. Um, got the uh, tub, you know, if you, Got little kids or whoever, anybody, even adults who might want to take a bath instead of just a shower. And then as we make our way into the um, room where we sleep at, there's two. Marcy says these are queen size bed. They look small to me, but 
They must be queen size bed. They look too big to be full size bed. Then you got, for a nice thing, you got a little chest of drawer over here. And you got plenty of plugs. We already got our stuff plugged in here. We got our stuff plugged in there. Plenty of plugs. Got a chest for a nightstand. Two beds, very comfortable beds. We slept on them last night. Got uh, maybe a 50 inch TV there. Got plenty of uh, space to put all your stuff. As you see, we got ours kind of scattered around everywhere. It does come with a fridge, a little mini fridge there. And uh, But the only thing I don't like is it doesn't have a microwave. There is no microwave in here. Got three drawers there, a little thing that slides out here, a footstool, whatever, where you can sit and Marcy puts her makeup on there or whatever. Got a little stand. But here's the best part about it, not just the fact that you get a view of Volcano Bay. We weren't here last night to see the fireworks. We were at uh, uh, Universal Studios. But I hear the fireworks was phenomenal from here. But here's the view from our room. Wow. Such a nice view. And the pool is in the shape of a fish. Isn't that crazy? Plenty of seating. Got the bar down here. We can grab some delicious drinks. You can see Garrett down there. He'll hook you up with a, with a, uh, with a good drink and plenty of seating. We didn't have any problem finding seating. Shade might be a little hard to find at times. Right now the sun is over blocking part of the pool, but during the day the, it's hard to find some shade down there. So make sure you get there early if you want one of the umbrellas. And right there is the lobby. And we will, uh, if we hadn't showed you that, we will show you that in just a minute. But you can really get these rooms at a good price sometimes. So we've gotten this one for $115, I think, one time. Plus, there's a $19 a day uh, parking fee, but there is no resort fee, so that's a plus. And if you park, uh, if you're at any of the hotels, you can catch the buses to Universal City Walk and go from there. And that ain't too bad of a deal either because then you don't have to pay for parking while you're at the park. That's going to wrap it up for the room tour. Hope you like this tour and uh, give us a thumbs up. Hit the like button, subscribe. We really do appreciate it. And let's get on to the checkout.